Okay, we're going to solve the good question 1465. Maximum area of a piece of cake after horizontal and vertical cuts. Uh, this question came from weekly contest 191. Alright, gonna pause the video. Uh, pause the video if you want to take a look. Otherwise, I'm going to continue with the approach. So let's start from example one. Um, so the way to do this is by getting the inter uh, getting the intervals of your cuts uh, after sorting them. So you can see. Uh, after you sort your horizontal cuts, you get one, two, four. It's already sorted, but in case it's not, you need to sort them uh, with your maximum uh, cut at five. Uh, you sort your vertical cuts uh, with your uh, maximum width at four. So your maximum vertical cut is uh, is four. And you can see that um, the interval uh, for horizontal intervals is one, 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 two is one, two to four is two, and four to the maximum possible cut, which is at the end, is one. And likewise for the vertical cuts, as uh, you get one, because that's, that's like one, uh, zero to one, one to three, that's two, uh, and then three to four, no, no, that, that's one. It's actually one, my bad. And we need to keep track of the maximum horizontal interval, uh, which is two, uh, and the maximum vertical interval, which is two, and we can do this in uh, O of one space. Uh, and at the end, uh, we just take the maximums and multiply them um, to get the max area. All right, let's let's begin. All right. So um, we first, as we discussed, we want to sort. So next, uh, we we actually want to after it's sorted, uh, we actually want to check to see if the um, if the last cut is less than the maximum uh, possible cut uh, given by H and W respectively, um, and if it is less than those values, we just append them to uh, the sorted cuts. Next, uh, we want to start uh, finding out what our maximum intervals are. Now uh, we want to handle the case where if the index is greater than zero, uh, we need to subtract the this interval from the i minus one value uh, to get the actual interval. Now, uh, we need to check if interval uh, is greater than 
max, then just set int max to the interval. Alright. And we're gonna do something similar for the uh, vertical cuts. Just return the product of the maximum intervals. And uh, so the problem does mention since the answer can be a huge number, return this modulo 10 to the 9th plus 7. All right, let's submit and try. Wrong answer. All right, what is... Yep, success. I think that I made a little typo in there. It's supposed to be asterisk, asterisk for power, not the carrot symbol. Uh, but anyways, um, I hope this helps. All right, see you next time.